Hey guys, Clay and I are outside today, as you can probably see. The weather here in Texas is fabulous, so we thought we'd take advantage of it. So we're outside. You may hear noises. You may see a cat jump across this fence. Who knows? But we're going to film outside today. So we've been to the Army-Navy store a couple of weeks ago, and uh, one of our favorite YouTubers, Emmy from Emmy Made in Japan, showed some MREs and then she showed some also from the UK and that got us interested. We have never, I mean, I've never even seen one, much less tried it. So Clay and I went out to the Army Navy store and we got some to try ourselves. We got marinara sauce with meatballs. Now I don't like that on a good day, so I'm probably not going to like this one. And then Clay has buffalo chicken and I thought, I, I might possibly like that one. I don't know. Which one would you like to try first, Clay? The buffalo chicken? All right, here goes. You cut it open for us. It says peelable seal. I don't really know what that means, so we're just going to cut into it to see how easy or to get Man, into it easy. I think you're just kind of holding them crooked. All right. This is what it looks like. See what's in there, man. Hmm. The weather is just, it's cool. It's like 60 degrees, low humidity. I could live like this all year long and it would be wonderful. Okay, he's got a, a wheat snack bread, mashed flat. Look at that. All right, and we've got... Um, Cheese spread with jalapenos. Yeah, isn't that cool? He's got some. Oh, this is the flameless um, ration heater. This is what you, we're going to heat it up with. This is mocha cappuccino instant powder. Look, it's got the little indentions cut out on the side so you can hold it, and I guess like a cup, you know. How funny is that? Okay. This one says. Uh, this is the fried rice in this little box, and that one, let's turn over on the other side. That one is the chicken pulled with buffalo style sauce, also in a little flat box. Okay, let me see. Did it come with an instruction? Here's a, it says a hot beverage, oops, gee, a hot beverage pouch. It also has a Spoon. It has. Did I already say what that was? Mm -hmm. Oh no, I didn't say what that was. This is patriotic cookies. Look, it's got a package of M&Ms in it. And then this package has some little gum right here. It's got a, a moist towelette. It's got. Um, I think this is hot chocolate back here. Uh, tissues. Probably some salt and sugar or something like that, but we'll see. Okay, Clay, let's, did it give us any instructions? Oh, geez. Okay, Clay's going to start, knead, this is the cheese, and it says to knead the package before opening. So you're just going to roll it around in your hands like that to kind of warm it up and make it soft. And then for our, we won't do, we won't have to do anything to that. We won't have to do anything to that or to that. Let's, uh. This box, the end of the, the box has a date on it, and it says it's good until 2018. Wow. Okay. Let's see. Oh, my goodness. This is the chicken, and it just feels like, you know how if you get those bags of, uh, uh, you get the macaroni and cheese with the, the bags? This is what it feels like, the cheese. It's just, I feel a lump every now and then, but. Now, we had a hot drink one time, and we uh, had to poke it to, to make it, oh, okay, it, it tears open, oh my goodness, okay, so now Jeannie, you may be getting down to business, crazy, okay, here's the instructions, y'all. They didn't come without any. I was thinking, they must teach this in class or something, because I don't know that you just know how to do this. Um, 
you m remove the MRE pouch from the carton and save the carton. This, this, I bet this is what it says, okay? Now, while holding the MRE pouch and heater, what? While holding MRE pouch and heater above lines on bag, pour water into bag until it reaches a level between the lines. I don't see no lines. Was your lines on the no, that's a different one. That's a different one. Oh, maybe it says tear on this. Tear here. And then we pour six ounces while holding the MRE pouch and heater and heater above line on bag. Pour water into bag until it reaches a level between the lines. Okay. Slide heater and MRE to the bottom of the bag and hold top of bag to side opposite of the heater. Okay. We're supposed to say this box that it came out of. Okay, so let's pour six ounces of water in here. To the box. No, it said, but to, no, 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 not six. I'm sorry. It says to the lines, like fill it between the lines. Oh, look, y'all. Holy shit. Oh, it's hot. Oh, my goodness. Y'all, it's that, hot. That, that's oh, my goodness. It says, now put this down in here. Holy moly cow. Put this down in here. And then fold the top down. And put it back in your box. Oh, I can't. It's going to... It's swelling up. Wait a minute. Did I not do something right, Clay? If I blow us up, I'm going to be upset. Why is it... Oh my God, Clay, feel how hot that is. Yeah, that's pretty that is insane. You know what? It is so hot. I, I'm not, look, I, I'm already not following directions. I'm going to lay this rice right up under it because it can heat them both at the same time. I don't pull that off. Uh, yeah, we're going to put this one right there under it because it can heat both of these boogers at one time. How does that man see it? Okay, what else do we need to heat up? Like, we get all this mess heated up at one time. That's the drink. We don't heat that up just yet. Ouch! And how long does it tell us to look? It keeps. I must have not done something right. It keeps swelling up. How many minutes? It's this thing. No, it's not like burning the last yet. That is insane how hot this thing gets. Wow. And then this is a cookie and some bread. Is it looking, is it stinking bad? It's just a steaming up a storm, y'all. Yeah, if you were out in the the um, desert. desert or whatever, holy cow! This is some cocoa. This is mocha cappuccino instant powder. Goodness gracious! How many minutes? I don't remember it saying how many minutes. You should let this stand. Look, there it goes bubbling up again. I don't know if y'all can see this. I haven't done it right, so of course I'm, I got some mess going on here. I got it all bubbling up. I got it all swelling up. There's no telling. Look, see, if I was out in the field, they wouldn't want me out in the field because I'd blow everybody up trying to eat supper. That ain't even right. Okay. Is that crazy or what, Clay? 
And then let's see if we wanted to, while that's heating up, we're going to go ahead. You want to open the bread, Clay? I would assume you just tear it like that while we're waiting on our food to heat up. I think you just, yeah, just tear it like that. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> ain't beautiful. Yeah. Look, y'all. Look at this piece of bread. I'm not Look sure that. I want to eat that. It's... Oh, it smells real yeasty. There you go, sir. It's very thick. If you can see that. You know what it tastes like? It tastes like you took two pieces of bread and stuck them together and drove over it with a truck. It's bread. It's very flowery. I don't like Very, uh, really yeasty smelling. Chalky. Yeah, I mean, if you're out in, in you know, war time or whatever, I'm sure you'd welcome whatever you had, but Yeah. What else have we got we can try, Clay? Oh, we got to try our cheese sauce. Um, we got, I'm going to open the patriotic cookies. We'll try our patriotic cookies. While we wait. My scarecrow back here says, if I only had a brain. Some days I feel like that too. If I only had one, of you doing some good. <laughs> All right. Oh, okay. I'm going to hold one up. These look like little ginger snap cookies, kind of. Like a, um, yeah, you can go ahead and hold up the summer flags. So, oh, summer the... One is a Statue of Liberty. One is a flag. There's uh, Uncle Sam's hat. Oh, there's another design. There was an eagle, but he's broken. You can't see all of him. Yeah, it smells just like a, it's like a vanilla wafer. Yeah, vanilla wafer, Teddy Graham. Um, that's what that reminds me of. It's a it's a decent. I mean, you know, nice. If you're out in the desert, like I said, or wherever, you'd welcome that. But I don't know that I would search that out to eat. But what do you think, Clay? How warm are we? Ooh, it's getting warm, isn't it? Let's turn it over that way for a minute. Holy moly, cow! That thing gets hot. That's crazy, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And then, of course, we have the M&M's that we know what M&M's taste like. All right. And then all we have left is our mochaccino drink thing. How funny they've got it shaped like a... You, it's just got a powder down there. You want to smell it? You want to smell it? You don't want to smell it? Okay, we're going to pour some water in here. Let me see what we've got. I don't know. Wait, wait. It's still not enough. Okay, I think that's about enough water. That's it. It's got a zip lock on the top of it. We'll zip it back closed. Give it a good shake up. Now, I guess if you liked cold coffee or whatever, you could just drink this cold. But we'll lay it on this one and let it get warm like hot chocolate. What do you think? We're going to go ahead and lay it on our little warmer. <gasps> and I just mashed some out on the table because I was going to mash the air out of it so it would lay down better. Gina. Okay, we're going to lay it on our warmer. 
see how if it'll, if it'll warm up. We look like we're having a picnic out here. We got crap laying everywhere. Now see, I don't know what they would do out in the field. I mean, would you just eat this out of the bag? Mix it up. Oh. Oh. I put the, the rice and the buffalo chicken in the bowl together. Oh my God. Does it, what does it smell like to you? Doesn't smell on that one. Holy, you know what it smells like to me? I don't know if you have had babies, but if you have those little jars of like that meat, meat um, like the turkey and I don't know, uh, I don't know, it smells like that nasty baby food. Tear at the corner. This is our cheese stuff. Give me those scissors. I'm not going to sit here and make a mess with this cheese everywhere, hopefully. So now we're going to put our cheese over it. Oh my heavenly days. What was that? I'm scared to know. <laughs> scared to know. I don't want to look too close at it. I think it was a hair, but I, I, I know it wasn't mine. Pretty sure it wasn't Clay's. And I put the cheese over the top of it. We're going to just kind of mix that in. Like if we were out and I hadn't had anything to eat in uh, a month. No, not really. Uh, I'm sure my bell butt would get hungry before a month. But I'd have to be hard pressed to want to eat this because of the smell. Ah! What the hell, Chloe? <sighs> Chloe's out here with us and she obviously has seen a cat or something. Really? Ah! It's okay, it's okay. Okay, so I don't know what they do out in the, the desert or wherever when they're at war, how they mix this together, but we went and got a bowl and put it in it, and uh, all right, Clay, get your spoon. Here goes nothing. Yum. <laughs> it smells like baby food. It smells, uh, you, can, you can smell like kind of a buffalo hot wing sauce. Very fake cheesy, kind of uh, spicy, hot like bacani. The chicken, you can tell it's been sitting in water, you know, like, or whatever. It, in a pinch, you'd be very happy to get this, but mm. I'm not in a pinch, <laughs> so it's not good to me. I mean, it's not bad, I'm, it's really not, but um, like I that said, it could be the worst thing I ever eat. That, what I thought was a hair, look, was this chicken. It's, it's the chicken, so it wasn't a hair. Very cheesy, very fake tasting, very Terrible. a lot of pecani, fake pecani tasting. It, if you didn't have anything else to eat, this would be good. And the packet heats it fabulous. I mean, you know, like, oh my God. It, it's MRE, what that, can I say? That's the terrible thing I eat. Clay said it's the most terrible thing he's ever eaten. The worst. The worst yeah. thing I've eaten. This is the cappuccino drink. Let's pull that out. I didn't bring a cup out here to try this out of. I'm, I'm assuming this is just... Do you want to try it? You don't. I'm not a cappuccino person, but I'm going to drink it straight out of this bag. <laughs> it's probably, cappuccino lovers would probably like that. It, it has like a milky, chocolatey coffee flavor. I don't like coffee. But, um, you know, I, I really, I, I'm, I'm, you know, I think it's awesome how they go to the trouble to give them not like just food, but they gave them M&Ms and, you know, uh, cappuccino and, and some hot chocolate. And I mean, they try to give them other things that make it a little bit better than just nourishment. You know, it's a little bit of fun. But, um, okay, guys, that was our buffalo chicken one. And we, this thing is still, it's not like when I first did it, I couldn't even touch it. It was so hot. And now, I mean, I still can't hold on to it for very long because it's so hot. So 
That is amazing. All right. I don't think I want to eat anymore. <laughs> I don't think I do either. I don't. Okay, let me do that. Let's see. Okay, we gave this buffalo chicken one that we thought we might kind of like a fair try. Now, I don't like uh, marinara sauce. I don't like meatballs. So, um, our oldest son is here today, and we're going to let him try that one. We're not going to try this one. No. We're just going to try the, the bacon one and, and uh, let that be that. So, thanks, guys, for watching. See ya. See ya. <laughs>